I just made this little acai bowl. I just want to talk to y'all a little bit. Mm. Shit, bless him. All right. So I want to talk to y'all a little bit about why I'm trans. I chose to be trans because I didn't fucking choose to be trans. Okay. Let's get that straight. I didn't fucking choose to be trans. I didn't choose. To, I didn't choose to be trans, bro. And a lot of people. Maybe really it's crazy. Yeah, you know, it sounds dumb, but a lot of people really think I chose to be trans or like That's something had to happen to me to be trans type shit Like no one not no one but Some people don't think about the fact that maybe I'm trans because I was born like this the same reason why you're cis or whatever is because you were born like that you didn't get to choose to be cis or whatever People don't get that. And recently, I've heard some shit from my family that um a family member has decided to hypothesize why they believe I'm trans and their reasoning is that I've been sexually abused um, sexually whatever something has happened to me traumatic sexually or something like that in my childhood that has caused me to be trans which I think is absurd because why does being trans or being gay even always have to tie into traumatic experiences or something negative um, I don't understand that. I, re I really don't understand that because like the same way you are you is the same way I am me. Nothing had to happen for us to be ourselves, if that makes sense. Like, you know, there is some instances though where people do transition um, to escape traumatic experiences. Like there's this one uh, person, I'm not sure their pronouns, but they transition FTM, so like me, um, and then they found out later that the reason that they transitioned was because they wanted to transition into a man, someone that could protect their younger self because as a child they were um, sexually abused or whatever. So that is like the one story I've heard where trauma actually leads into transition. And that's rare. And first of all, usually if you're really trans, um, look, I've been through so many therapy sessions. I've been through so much just, just... But yeah, like I was saying, I've been through so many therapy sessions, so much just levels and steps to make sure that I'm really trans. So if someone, most trans people, like 99% trans people have to go through the therapy and all that stuff, right? So if I've went through all the therapy and they still can't find that I'm trans because of traumatic experiences, what makes you think that you're the psychologist, you're the therapist that can uh, the, the decide something so serious like that, you know what I mean? Like... This just boggles me, man. I'm tired of that shit. Like, people assuming I'm trans because of all these other reasons. Um, this, that, and the third. This, that, and the third. No, I'm trans simply because I'm trans. I don't know what else you want me to tell you. Like, this is just me. Um, yeah. Anyways, though, I'm gonna also make, I'm gonna make a two-in-one video. I'm gonna bless y'all a little bit. I'm sorry if the lighting is weird. It's because I'm literally, like, in the sun. But not in the sun. I'm under an umbrella. But, um, this is a little update, too. Um, let me see how long I've been off tea so I got off on my last shot was on the 28th right so so I'm like um, about to be a month and two weeks off tea um, yeah I kind of expected it to be this long um, it's just really like a lot of waiting my tea levels were too high so I couldn't start like I said another video so uh, I'm not even gonna eat this acai bowl because honestly it kind of melted it's hot outside I already fucked it up a little bit, so it's okay. I don't worry. I'm not. I'm not worried about it. But um, yeah. So I'm about two, about to be a month and two weeks off tea. Um, my levels weren't good, so now they're at where they should be. I just took another blood test on like like a week ago, so now they're good. I'm gonna be going in on Thursday to um, see if I can start, and it's really up in the air if I can start or not because, like I said in another video as well, the previous one, no, two videos ago, that um. I did have a cycle so I guess that throws it off because if I just 
So I don't know if y'all know, but like, um, when people have a cycle, it's when like uh, the lining of like your uterus or some shit comes off and that's why you bleed. So, which like holds the eggs or some shit like that. So obviously if I had a cycle, that means like my eggs are not ready. I don't fucking know the specifics, but I know from my doctor that she told me that since I did have a cycle last week, that like it kind of, it might, it may or may not throw it off basically. So Thursday I'll see if I start, um, I may be able to start Thursday or the, or the day after, so Friday. If not, then I'm probably gonna end up having to wait like another week, another week and a half, another two weeks, I don't know. Um, it is what it is though. I, I was sad at first that like, there's not really like a definite start date and like it's just up in the air. It's not, it's not definite, right? But then again, I kind of gave myself, when I went off tea, I gave myself the knowledge that I knew I'm going to be off tea for a month or two. It doesn't mean a month. It can mean a month or two, anywhere between a month or two. I really do not expect me to be off tea any longer than two months. Two months is the max because, um, yeah, I'm about to be, I haven't, I haven't hit a month in two weeks. So, there's a fly. I'm so sorry. I haven't hit a month in two weeks. So, I have about two weeks. So, if I start Thursday, um... It's a 10 day process, meaning in 10 days I will be done with this, so it can't go any longer than that. So I won't hit two months. Um, yeah, two months is really where I'm just gonna be at, at that point. I'll be like, Y'all just, just gotta keep, I'm gonna just keep my eggs. Y'all ain't taking these hoes from me, it's too much because, yeah, bro, being off tea is definitely a mental fuck. Um, I literally had a little breakdown earlier because it's just so, I don't know, it's just crazy to know that I'm functioning without tea. And to me, I feel like I look completely different. Um, I know for sure, I just feel a little weaker. Plus, I did have a cycle. I hate fucking saying that word, but I had a cycle, so I did not go to the gym for like three days. Yeah, three days, because I was just trying to survive at that point. Like, it's bad. I don't even want to leave my house type shit. So, um, yeah, like my gym schedule is kind of thrown off. Basically, everything's kind of thrown off. I'm really revolving my life around this egg retrieval process, which is fine. I expected that. Um, it's whatever, because when I come back. <laughs> I'm gonna be back, that's all I gotta say. I mean, I still got games. It's just me geeking, talking about, I don't look the same, blah, blah, I don't know. Let me know in the comment section if I look the same. Actually, don't let me know in the comment section, because if I don't look the same, I really don't want to know from y'all, okay? Don't let me know. I was kidding. But yeah, I'm gonna go hit the gym in a bit anyway, so I'm still on the grind. It's just that, like, uh, T helps your muscles build faster type shit, or build more, um, yeah, uh, it's just kind of science but uh yeah other than that though i'm doing all right i mean uh just doing it day by day uh not much more i can say but thank y'all for watching um really thank y'all for watching watching my crazy ass i make all these videos and supporting me and all this shit like i hella appreciate it just wait just wait this is just the beginning i always say that but this is just the beginning i have so many more um things i want to do so many more things i want to accomplish uh, this is really just the beginning so stay tuned for that shit I appreciate y'all once again if you have any questions any questions I know there's a lot of guys out there that want to do this process and you know uh, if I didn't cover it in this video just ask me I'm an open book kind of um, depends what you're asking me but yeah just let me know in the comment section or you can hit me up on my IG I always post my IG in my bio it's Nigerian dad so like Nigerian N-I-G-E-R-I-N and then dad with two D's check the bio for that shit but yeah Peace out, y'all. Later.